Yay. Hey -o. Hi. So, okay. We're not recording yet. Are we not? No. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not. <laughs> Hi. Hi. So, we're back for round two, mm -hmm. right? I'm Diego. Edward. And so, so we had such an exceptional time with the, uh, <laughs> with the fire noodles that I, because I did it. He did. I walked into a gas station and I saw the Pocky Haunted Ghost Pepper uh, tortilla chips. And so I'm curious because, so are you, don't open them yet. I was just flipping them around over here. Oh, okay. Well, I, so, okay. So the whole thing is, right, the Pocky Ghost Pepper chips, um, they garnered a whole bunch of attention when they, um, so, I don't know, do you know about it? Mm -mm. Shall I tell him? Shall I tell you? Ooh, tell me. It's story time. It's story time. So, okay. So the whole Pocky Ghost Pepper thing, I want to get closer to you. There you go. The whole Pocky Ghost Pepper chip, um, you basically, it's, it's a, it was a one, one chip challenge. And so you would order them say on Amazon or whatever, and they'd send you a little box in the shape of a coffin and it contained one chip. Oh, so I only have to eat one. No, you don't. I mean, cause if you can see it has a warning. Yeah, no, it's freaking hot. Well, it's gee. Huh. Mm -hmm. um, and so how do we put the haunt in haunted ghost pepper? There's more, more ghost pepper. There's more ghost, ghost pepper, pepper. Ghost pepper in the ingredients list. And more ghost pepper. More. Oh, lovely. Um, and so a coworker today told me that you can't order the single chip ghost pepper coffin box anymore. Well, that's a shame. Isn't that ridiculous? So anyway, here we are with an entire baggie that I bought at Love's Gas Station in Westlaco, Texas. Um, it might be reversed. You might not even be able to read Pocky. <laughs> Use your imagination, all right? I don't know. Um, so, I told him we should talk about scary movies. Scary movies because he and I like them so much. What, and it's ghost pepper. And it's ghost. So we're sticking with the Politics. general theme. Okay, wait, 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 wait. 100% real ingredients. So it's ground corn, right? Canola oil and or sunflower oil. Ghost pepper. So there's like real ghost peppers in this. Cayenne pepper, chipotle pepper powder. Wow. We just put in all the peppers. All the peppers. Chili powder. Mm. Um, so yeah, I was thinking we could just like one of our one of our favorite things to bond over uh, are scary movies. Yes. And with some ghost pepper chips, uh, I mean, like, why not, right? So the whole thing though is, I I need you to finish as much of it as possible. One chip. I'm writing the I'm writing the rules as we speak. I need you to finish as much of it as possible. One chip. No. And wait. Oh, just smelling Dude, it. Well, just um, smelling it. Just a smell. All right. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? Cheers. Are you ready though? Cheers. Just say yes or no. I said yes. I'm okay. ready. I already said that. We're gonna toast. Oh. Does it come later or what? Mm, I don't know. I got tingly tongue business right now. Mm. Mm -hmm. They're good. Mm -hmm. They're really good. Like really good. Mm. With some cheese dip, this would be fabulous. I mean, it's hot. Mm. But not super. No. Oh man. Okay. It's nothing like the noodles. No, not at all, but it's tasty. 
Uh, mm-hmm. So, okay. Oh, man. I got powder in my nose. Mm. Mm. So, okay. Why, let's talk remakes. Mmm. What's your favorite? Mmm. I really like a Nightmare on Elm Street remake. The one with Rooney Mara. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The muscular dude from Twilight. What's his name? Kellen Lutz. Kellen Lutz. Was he shirtless in this one? He was not. Oh. Maybe that fight wasn't as good as it could have been. Who else came out? Was Kyle Gallner in that? Yes. Yes. And Jackie Earl Haley as Freddy. Um, Jackie. Mm. Yeah. I appreciated that one because Freddy was not as campy. Mm -mm. Unless he was in the original movies. Oh, it's getting hot. But, or rather, they made a, a solid effort at making him quite scary. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I thought so. I couldn't do it. <laughs> it's hot! But they're good. Mm. Okay, so I mentioned in our first video, the noodle challenge, right? Uh, BT Dubs, this is fresh made guacamole from a grocery store here in Texas. And it's so good. Are you mm. not gonna say which grocery store? Mm, I don't know, should I? H-E-B. -E yeah, well, it's fresh made guacamole. From H -E -B. And it is so dang good. Um, and it really nicely tempers the spice of the chip. Mm. If only I liked guacamole. He hates guacamole. Mm. It's avocado in general. Okay? It's avocado, yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Are, are you Canadian again? Not Canadian. Not even for a second. I wouldn't mind it. They're lovely people. That is true. If you're Canadian, Say hi in the comments below. Yes, please? Okay, fine, so your favorite remake is, oh my God, it's so hot. Um, Nightmare on Elm Street. Uh, I don't know favorite, but it's, it's the first one that came to mind. Uh, Yours is the ex, uh, not the exorcist. <laughs> Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Mm-hmm. Mm. Jessica Biel. Mm-hmm. But I mentioned that last time, so mm -hmm. we'll do a different one. This is a very divisive topic, right? It divides many. Suspiria, the remake. <laughs> Who does that divide? It was awful. Whoa, fighting words, hey? You fell asleep. Uh-huh, mm -hmm. but I know a lot of people who thought it was really, really good. Mm. It was too long, too, too long. Mm -hmm. It was mostly gray. It was just like, it was the literal Fifty Shades of Grey. Uh, everything was grey. The building, the weather, the sky, Germany, the clothes. Dakota Johnson's acting. Uh, oh, how come when I eat spicy, my ears are just the first ones to go? I don't know. I did appreciate the part. <clears throat> Ooh, I'm feeling it now. Mm. How are you so chill about this? I want water. Oh. I do appreciate the scene where they turn that chicken to a pretzel. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm. I'm not saying there were not good scenes. It was just super long, super gray. Mm -hmm. Part of the time it was hard to tell kind of what was going on. I wouldn't know. Because you were asleep. Because I fell asleep. How close are we to the bottom? Mm. You're doing a better job than I am. Mm. Was Piranha a remake? I'm not sure. With Elizabeth Shue and what's the... Christopher Lloyd? No, no, no. Oh yeah, the Christopher Lloyd, but the one that got his, you know what, you know, in the ocean mm. with the piranhas. Who's that? Jerry... Jerry O'Connell. Is that it? Oh, I think so. The one married to Rebecca Romaine. Is he? I don't know if it's technically a remake, right? Re-envisioning? Maybe. A new idea? Mm. Mm. I think it's a remake. Mm. Well, it's a piranha from a few years ago where Elizabeth, she was super buff and like, it, 
is gory and gross and nasty and entertaining. That's a really good one. It was not scary. Not scary, but good. What's another really solid one? What's another really solid horror remake? Oh my god. Mm. They've remade the Amityville horror like 15 times. And the one with Ryan Reynolds shirtless cutting wood. Excellent. That was like the only remake. All the other ones are just like... Envisioning, re reimagining. Re sequel. Mm. There was one with Bella Thorne. From 2018, no one watched that one. I don't, I don't think. I didn't. We didn't. No. Well, what about what about TV show then? When they turn Scream into a TV show? Like what? What are your thoughts on that? Like when they make TV show the movie? No. When they turn Scream the movie into a TV show. Scream. Mm -hmm. With M is in Mary at the end. Scream. Yes. I heard scream. I heard scream. No. N is in Nancy. No. M is in Mary. Ah! It's hot. Um, I haven't watched a TV show. Mm -hmm. mm. Um, I do know. Ah, hi. Okay. Recurring theme. Bella Thorne. I know she's in the first episode. She dies really early on. Thank goodness. Spoilers. Spoilers, Edward. Not everyone has seen it. They're not missing out on much. No. But as avid a horror fan as I am, uh, I haven't really followed that whole thing. Mm. It must have been good. Because people liked that. I got enough for a second season. All that. And some... Ah! He beat me. Okay. I accept defeat because you're hot, dude. And I feel like maybe they'd be really, really good alongside a sandwich. Um, and since I'm making dinner tonight, it's gonna be sandwiches. Yay! Yay! Um, anyway, I don't feel like actually cooking anything, so. Um,. I might just fin I, I might just finish these later. Is that okay? That's fine. Yay! I get I get a hall pass. You do. No. Oh my god. <laughs> no. You get, a, you get a pass, not a hall pass. <laughs> I get a pass. I don't have to finish my chips. I don't get a hall pass, and we know it's for dinner. So I think it was a pretty. And we talked about scary movies. Or the not so scary, or whatever, right? We talk about movies, movies. and TV shows. And so. TV shows, yeah. So it was like a pretty productive 15 minutes, I think, I'd say. Excellent. Mm-hmm. Mm. But humongous thank you for once again joining us in our second super spicy taste test alliteration. Second super spicy taste test. Um, we hope you're having a really, 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 really wonderful Tuesday mm -hmm. week so far mm, Tuesday whatever uh, it'll probably be week tomorrow when this goes up I think it'll go up tomorrow it just it should. De just depends on Wi-Fi and YouTube and whatever anyway we are gonna go have dinner now my exquisitely put together uh, turkey and cheese Ooh. sandwiches <laughs> and we will see you guys later Bye. Bye! Oh, it's still recording. <laughs>